she also has mentioned where you do something and then you have to end up running to a store to get something or to oh, buy yeah. something oh, after yeah. you've broke it or something. Especially, I'm always going to the store to get things that everybody needs. Not only what I need, but what everybody else needs. She also mentioned when you punctured the holes in the refrigerator that you had to end up going to the store to get some glue. Oh, I did, yeah. I was trying to save her the misery of uh, the top of the refrigerator leaking, which it was leaking before and it's still leaking, and patched up the tiny little holes. I'll tell you how tiny, how big those holes were. They were about as big as a pencil lid. But when you hear her tell the story, you think you chopped the hole in there as big as a quarter. Five years old. Five years old. She's a quarter, and there's a jar. She is. Her teeth out. Thirteen. Wait, when is that? When is that? Since we were thirteen. Man says, "Be, be whole." She said, "Be whole." Be whole. Be whole. That the difference between the two. I don't think they do. It looks like this is the expiration date, or was. <laughs> it was the expiration date. I can't even see. It's <laughs> so old, it doesn't tell you nothing. The expiration date is worn off, Matt. It's so old. <laughs> Big old. Oh my god. Where's all these people? 2014. What do you have to say about this? It's a hoarder. Costco, I don't know, maybe four or five months ago. And she went to look for it and she couldn't find it. She said, oh, you've eaten up all the... No, I didn't need all the... I said, you moved them somewhere. So I went and got another bag. Oh. And won't you know, she found that first bag. <laughs> oh, I remember putting it there now. Wait, yeah, was, you was it? You were well, yeah, probably, yeah, probably when you were born. When I was born. Gosh. So they were just as old as... <laughs> They're older than I really am. <laughs> this is evidence and confession. I remember for always noticing those in there and I'm thinking, why? What is that here? Nobody eats them. Just like that. And they just stayed. Aren't they, they made a home and never left. Well, wait, 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 wait. Better with peppers and a spice. Here's the thing, though. Remember, they got a new refrigerator not too terribly long ago. No, she moves. She moved the stuff out. Yeah, but you would think if she was in the day. Well, she was in the day. 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 She was his tools. And he leaves his tools. And the job is done. Okay, I'll take you to the side yard. And what do you do about all this? Well, as you see, I've just left it there. This is what's remaining of this Clorox bush. What about those ladders right there? Oh, well, there you go. He left those out. He used the weed stalk and then he just left it there. I mean, why not? And then he used the water hose and then he leaves it there. Then I have to get out on my mower, move the water hose, rewind it up so I don't run over it and kill it. And so, but that's what he does. Okay. Uh, oh, there's that ladder over there. Anything I else? I think that's all that I've got to show you right now. And what do you do about all this? Well, some things I leave, some things I clean up. Sometimes I, you know, make the pillows neat again. But then it's not long. The next time he sits on the couch, he leaves a mess again. <laughs> and he always leaves his chair out at the table, but... He's poo-pooed me on that idea. She can't compete. She can't what? Compete. Because you have it all nice and neat? Yeah, I mean, I've been doing it since I was 12 years old. 
She was only two, three years old when I started doing it. So you should be much better than me. <laughs> oh, I am. Come along and clean for me. You want to pick, take a picture of this wet cement he dropped on the floor? Yeah, a lot of this it. basket here. That's a mess she made. He was in such a rush to get more cement that I, I was rushing. She was so careless she dropped it. Was rushing. Careless. Are we going to put any across the top of this um, upside wall here? Which wall? Where we have the ceiling. You mean on the ceiling? Yeah. The wall. No, the wall I, to the ceiling. Now I mentioned to that mentioned that to you yesterday. I didn't want to be messing with it ceiling that's already there. So he just he just accused you of making a mess. Yeah. He did. I just worked all day. Did you take a picture of that mess right there? It's hers. All over the basket. And it's not a basket with a smooth edge, it's a basket that's just got holes in it. You gotta take it outside and run a water hose on it. It'll harden. I know and then you won't have to do anything. <laughs> it will harden. That's why it needs to be done immediately. Well, why don't you jump up in your $69 jeans and go clean it up? Because <laughs> I'm afraid they'll get dirty if I jump up. Oh, they are already got a piece of glue stuck on the back. <laughs> Makes it look like you had an accident. I'm just working. Doing what I do best. Cleaning up his mess. It up so nicely, and she came along and slapped her trowel over it. She said, Oh, I am so sorry. I said, That's all right, sweetheart. I'll fix it for you. I don't think I heard the word sweetheart. I haven't heard that in goodness, maybe never. He's not one for sweet terms to his gorgeous wife. Oh, I I also said you don't need to buy me Valentine's presents, but I didn't mean it. <laughs> now my body's getting weak. <laughs> and they say when you laugh, you're, it's hard for you to like... It's good for your abs. It's, yeah, but it also makes you weak in your hands. Like it's hard for you to write because you're laughing. Well, laugh, and then put your pen down for a while. Enjoy the moment. I'm I'm done. I'm quitting. Oh, you've got all kind of stuff in the cracks of your shoes. I'll wash it off with a hose like you should do there. <laughs> put that back. <coughs> Don't make a mess now. Oh, we just did. It went on the back side of the tray. Whoa! You see how I have to clean up after him? <clears throat> so okay. my stick that in um, here and just rake off your Yeah. Before so covered up. So apparently Mama was working down here by herself. And while she's working, I've noticed there's blood. There's blood on the wall. Uh, so what do you have to say about this, Mama? Um, your grandfather, the klutz of all klutzes, <laughs> cut himself while he was cutting a piece of drywall. He cut right through the drywall and right into his hand. Oh my gosh. He cut three fingers. Three fingers? Not just two, <laughs> but three. Oh my gosh. What do you have to say about this? Um, it's par for the course. <laughs> <laughs> this is just another day in uh, the work life of Stanley Dalton. There was a lot of huffing and puffing going on too. <laughs> but if I say anything, he just tries to make me feel guilty by telling me how badly he feels. So, 
I probably shouldn't say anything. Man, there's like blood in certain spots. Yeah. Yeah, look down here. Oh, there's the blood that I saw. <laughs> the small one right here. Yeah. Your mom's got the car, but he left some on the car too. Oh boy. People are gonna wonder whether or not like there was the a axe, condom. The axe murderer is on the loose. Oh my gosh. And that's another part of he said she said. Evidence and convention. <laughs> Um, she also mentions how you're spend your the fact that you spend the money be, after you've done some, but you, you could have prevented it. That's what she said. What do I'm you have? I'm not to say sure about? what that means. I really don't know. Some of these things you can't figure her out on. The, the fact that like you could have prevented it, you didn't have to go back to a store to spend money just to go fix something that you've caused. That's what she's accused you of that you could have prevented that. What do you have to say? Uh, what I say is this, she didn't fix it, she never has fixed it, and I'll try to repair all the damage that she does. Who do you think is right in all of this? Well, you know, if you look at her real close, you'll see she's got angel wings. She's got a halo over her head. But if you look a little closer, you'll see fire coming out of her nose and out of her ears. Is that true? Oh, that's very true. I see it every once in a while. Who exaggerates the most? She does. <laughs> 